you know what, it's time to rank every Nintendo franchise ever made. Okay, so Nintendo has it's known for a ton of franchises. Um, they're all listed here. Um, and we'll be ranking them from S to F tier. Um, first is 1080 degrees. Um, the games are eh. <coughs> Kind of forgettable N64 game, um, D tier, um, N64 is overshadowed by much better games on the X64, next is Advanced Wars, only people who play on the Game Boy really have nostalgia for this, I haven't, I didn't really own that many games for it, so, I don't really have anything to say about Advanced Wars, or that it looks like an okay game, next is Animal Crossing, I'm not Golden Sun, Golden Sun's not Animal Crossing, Animal Crossing's pretty great. But Amiibo Festival dragged it down. Gotta remember Amiibo Festival exists. Amiibo Festival. That game was terrible. Um, Box Boy. That's that's not a Nintendo franchise. I don't know what you're tricking me here. So Box Boy is instantly FTL because Box Boy is not even Nintendo. That's because it had a that's because it had an Amiibo. That's because it had an Amiibo. Doesn't make you a Nintendo franchise. It's like saying Shovel Knight is a Smash is a Nintendo franchise because Shovel Knight had an amiibo. Doesn't make any sense. Next is TP Robo. First game was all white, but the game first game was good, but the rest of the games are brand to bad to terrible. So TP Robo. Um, I'm putting TP Robo in the CTL. Um, Nintendo's probably Nintendo's probably never gonna make another TP Robo again. So. Next is Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong had some okay games. It had some pretty good games. Can't move him past CTL. Can't put Donkey Kong in BTL. But Donkey Kong's a BTL franchise. Donkey Kong 64 is alright. The Country series is good. Um, the remake was good for Country and Tropical Freeze. I have not played that one. Um, Excite Bike. It's a pretty alright game. Won't go crazy over if there's a new game for it, but it's an all white game. Um, CTL. What's with this wrist? I can't move a sight bike. Next is F Zero. I actually haven't played a single F Zero game because Captain Falcon's from there, it's BTL. Next is Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem Gary games that I only played two games in the series. Uh, Fire Emblem Fates and Fire Emblem Awakening, both of them were good. So, B tier franchise on Game & Watch. Uh, Game & Watch is free. It's a arcade game, so it's not really that interesting. Once you play it, you, once you're done playing all the games, you've seen all the tricks and they're done. Next is Golden Sun. I haven't played a single Golden Sun game, so CTL. Just don't piss the Golden Sun fanboys off. Golden Sun will be in C tier. Next is Kid Icarus. Played the first one, it was eh. So, haven't played any of the other Kid Icarus's. So, let's play top that game. Kid Icarus is DTO. Kirby, um, all, all the Kirby games are good. Even the ones that people say are bad, all of them are good. So, Mario. There are some few bad Kirby games, but those are spin-offs. All the Mario games besides Super Mario, New Super Mario Bros. U is good. We, the remake of it, but that's a re that's a remake, a reprint of a game. So STL. Um, next is Metroid. Uh, you gotta remember that Metroid other M exists. So BTO. Earthbound. You know what? I'm not even gonna answer why Earthbound is FTL or Fox Boy. Um, Earthbound is easily one of the most overrated games ever made. Um, I think I had to piss off everybody for that next to Nintendo Dogs. It was a pretty fun game on the DS. So, pretty. It was a time waste game for the DS. So, pretty decent, decent game size. Pikmin, STL, easily Pikmin. But and even Hate Pikmin isn't that bad. I'm not gonna play Hate hey, Pikmin's an okay game. Uh, Pirate Wings. I haven't seen played a single game in Pirate Wings. The games look boring though, so FTL. Pokemon. 
The worst best go Pikachu and Eevee, so A tier. Pokemon is going downhill, so B tier. Oh wait. Why is Pokemon listed twice? There's a Pokeball and a Pokemon. Nintendo really? You had to put Pokeball and Pokemon on the same one. Next is Wario. No, okay, not the way. Next is Wario. Mm. I played like one or two Wario games, and that's it. So CTL. Punch Out. Uh, I don't like the Punch Out games. Okay, they're, they're not that fun. Next is Pussmo. Pussmo is an all-white -right game. Haven't played a sequel, so D tier as well. I even know there's a Nintendo. Um, next is Rhythm Heaven. Rhythm Heaven's like Game & Watch. Once you play all full, all the main games, the tricks are over. Uh, it's like a kind of like a one trick pony. Splatoon played the first game. It was okay. It was really good. So ATL. Star Fox. Well, the thing is, Star Fox they keep making bad games. Star Fox Zero. Star Fox Assault. No, not no, no, that that one. Wrong one. Star Fox Command. That's the one I was thinking about. The one for the DS. I'm sorry, Star Fox Assault. I didn't mean to assault you like that, but I'm talking about the Star Fox for the DS. Terrible. Um, and let's not forget the horrible Star Fox Adventures. Um, the only good game is the Star Fox Assault, Star Fox, and Star Fox 64. That's your guide on Star Fox games. So, CTO. Next is Super Mario. Why would I put Mario in STL? Oh, I think that's supposed to be the whole franchise. All the games are good except for New Super Mario Bros. Z Deluxe. Which is really a remake of a Wii U game, so that doesn't count. Smash Brothers, um, N3 FTL, we all know. Smash Brothers. Yoshi? Some of the games are good, and some of the games are just eh, too bad. Oh, the only bad game is the uh, Topsy Turvy. That doesn't really count because that's a spin off. So the main Yoshi games are good. Zero Blade, do not like the. Zero Blade is easily one of my least favorite Nintendo franchises. The first one was oh, the first one's impossible to get. Haven't played the one on the Switch, and the one for the Wii U sucks. So Zelda, um, okay, we cannot count the CDI games as Zelda games, okay? Awkward of time was uh, the Zelda games are not my game, so not my favorite game. So, and there are some bad Zelda games. It's really all the CDI games, but and Link's Crossbow Train, but that's hardly counts as a Zelda game. So, play. Two or three Zelda games, or four or five Zelda games, they're all good, decent, so. So, BTO. So, that's the real list of Nintendo franchises. Um, easily, um, you're coming from the most most great list of all time. Um, of course, if you really want to put your own rankings, you can, like these guys, let's go put down your own rankings instead of complaining, oh, you don't wake up Xenoblade or Earthbound. It's proof you hate JRPGs. You know what? I admit it. I don't like JRPGs as much as every other genre. Let's get over it. Goodbye. Oh yes. I told you. And of course, this is my opinion. Don't me be, don't yell at me over my opinion. Same thing with the Star Wars things and, the, and every other TOS video. It's my opinion. And I can say what I want about my opinion. As long as not frets or anything bad. Goodbye.